Hey guys, it's your girl Dee Dee and welcome or welcome back to the channel. I hope y'all are doing well. Thank y'all so much for tuning in once again. I am back with another reaction video. Now this video comes from a woman, you know, who says, you know, she did something with a guy and he gave her something and she's crying about it. She's sad about it. And I just want to get your thoughts on it. I want to get my two cents on it as well. Y'all know how I do. But before we get into the video, make sure you comment, like, subscribe to the channel. If you haven't already hit that notification bell to be notified when I upload new videos. So without any other further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. If you are sexually active and you know that you have an STD, then you need to inform people of that. Because when you don't, and you infect that person, you are changing their life forever, and they are making a decision that they do not know. Like, this shit is going to change the rest of my life. And there's nothing I can do. And I'm embarrassed. And I'm humiliated and I feel so stupid. I feel so stupid for letting someone take advantage of me in a moment of weakness. But I did not consent to this. And I'm going to get justice for myself. All right, so what do you guys think about this situation? For anyone who's out there, this is why it's so important to protect yourself. And I feel, you know, bad for her situation. I do, we're all human, people make mistakes. But this is why we talk about this so often. This is why we push the narrative that you shouldn't be out here having random relations with people. You shouldn't be out here putting yourself in a, a vulnerable state. I think so much of the focus is on having sex and enjoying yourself and people take it too far and they don't realize the consequences of their actions until something like this happens. And I think that if you're out here and you're sexually active, you should be responsible for your actions. You, you, if you out here and you got something, you need to let people know, or you shouldn't be out here trying to sleep with people. You know what I'm saying? So you need to be responsible for yourself, both men and women. I don't think that men should be going around or anybody willy nilly just out here sleeping with people, knowing that you have STDs or knowing that you have something you should let people know or just stay away from folks but i think what makes it a lot easier is because if you're out here just looking for a good time and you don't care who the person is these are the situations that you run into so as long as you're out here doing the do you're going to be exposed to something you're not going to go through a promiscuous lifestyle and never catch anything or never get anything you know get something from somebody or give something i mean that's just what it is because you're randomly throwing your body all around so you can expect and if you're out here doing these types of things that that comes with the territory in my opinion so if you want to avoid that the best thing to do is not spread yourself all around keep yourself intact and limit those outcomes by not just having random casual sex with anybody that you feel comfortable to do that with and there's not a look to all of this because a lot of times people used to think oh or if he look dirty or, 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 or if he or she look a certain way that you could tell maybe they might have something. No, the most attractive, clean cut guys and girls be the ones walking around burning and we'll give that to you without even letting you know what's going on. So you can't just go by a look. And unfortunately, a lot of these young women have put placed themselves out here in this promiscuous world. And I'm not saying she is because I don't know her personally, but you know, you got to understand you have to be very careful and cautious and, and really be concerned about who you're giving your body to. People aren't going to um, always disclose what's going on with them. They out here looking to have a good time and they don't care about all of this stuff. You're the one who's going to have to deal with that. You know, the same way when it comes to pregnancy, unwanted pregnancies, you know, if you're having sex and you're out here just randomly giving your body to people, you could either get some type of diseases, get pregnant or something much worse. You know, when I'm talking, I'm talking to women and I'm talking to young women too. Like, listen, be, my, be mindful of how you're putting your body out here. You shouldn't be out here having sex with random dudes that you barely know. You're supposed to be holding your body until marriage. So even though I feel for her situation, it's up to you to guard your own body and protect yourself because everybody else is not gonna care about that. You have to care more about yourself than anybody else. So you gotta be responsible and it's getting worse 
course out here. And so I would just advise any young person, listen, don't, you don't have to do that. You, there's plenty of time for you to enjoy yourself, you know, and I know as grown individuals, people like to have sex, but you got to be more picky about the people you're sleeping with. If that's what you're going to do. If you don't want, you worry, worry about marriage, you know, maybe I'm old and I'm old school and I'm like, you need to get married before you go out doing that. We know a lot of people aren't doing that. So if you're going to be out here doing it, you need to be very cautious, get tested to make sure you clean and make sure nobody have anything. And that way you'll feel a little bit more comfortable going into that situation. If that's what you choose to do, as opposed to just randomly thinking that it's okay. It's all good. He looked clean. She looked clean. Don't look like nothing wrong with him. So let's go ahead and do it. And then afterwards you in a situation like this crying and don't know what you're going to do with your life and upset about the outcome. So, you know, just be more cautious. That's all I'm saying. So I'm gonna leave it there. Y'all let me know what y'all think of this, this video comment, like subscribe. Y'all know what it is. Chime in in the comments. I want to hear your thoughts on this one. See you guys in the next one. Bye.